The Road to GH reveals the ongoing tense trial between Ava and Christina, with Rick secretly manipulating the situation. He exploits Christina's hot-headed nature, asking sharp questions designed to make her lose her composure in front of the jury. Rick's aim is to expose Christina's emotional instability, using her lack of self-control as the basis for his argument. He hopes that, if Christina shows signs of panic and anger, he can argue that she accidentally slipped, leading to the death of the child. This is a subtle tactic designed to weaken Christina's argument while creating an opportunity for Rick to gain an advantage in the courtroom. However, Rick's plan could be thwarted by witnesses like Molly and Dante, who are ready to provide key testimony in the trial. Their statements will shed light on the truth, proving that Christina was not responsible for her child's death in an unintentional manner. This new evidence undermines Rick's strategy, as these developments could derail the case. Nonetheless, Ava will still have to face consequences for her actions. Though she only unintentionally caused Christina to fall, the repercussions of her actions cannot be denied. However, because there was no malicious intent, Ava will receive a suspended sentence rather than a harsh penalty. Nevertheless, this trial will lead profound consequences for both parties, and Ava's responsibility cannot be erased. The trial's outcome leaves Christina unsatisfied. Though Ava is only sentenced to probation, Christina cannot accept that Ava will not be fully held accountable for her child's death. Feeling that justice has not been served, Christina decides to devise a plan to make Ava pay more severely for her actions. Christina begins seeking legal avenues and new evidence that could overturn the case, forcing Ava to face more serious consequences. She intensifies her efforts to ensure that Ava cannot escape responsibility, determined to make her pay for the harm she has caused. These actions make the situation even more tense, as Christina not only wants justice for her child, but also wants Ava to be punished for the damage done to her family. Christina, not only a grieving mother, but also a calculating individual, decides to create a sophisticated scheme to make Ava bear even more responsibility. She cannot tolerate that Ava only received probation after the trial, and a deep-seated hatred rises within her, not just for the death of her child, but also for the injustice she feels she has suffered. With revenge in mind, Christina starts to devise a detailed plan to make Ava face serious consequences. She approaches Ava carefully, trying to gain her trust without raising suspicion. In a secret meeting, Christina stages a fake scene, making it appear as though Ava attacked her in a fit of rage. She inflicts minor injuries on herself and records signs of emotional distress, such as tears and words full of resentment. Christina then cleverly convinces others that Ava savagely assaulted her, claiming that the attack has deeply affected her physical and mental health, rendering her unable to live a normal life. Christina knows that by claiming serious injuries, both physical and emotional, it will be easier to convince the authorities that Ava must be held accountable for these damages. She goes to great lengths to create the image of a helpless victim, while in reality, she is manipulating the situation to trap Ava in a difficult position. Armed with the fabricated evidence, Christina goes to the authorities and accuses Ava of assault, ensuring that Ava will not be able to avoid investigation. Christina's statements about her mental and physical harm prompt doctors and psychologists to conclude that she has suffered greatly after the fake attack. As a result, Ava, who seemed to have escaped punishment, now faces the possibility of actual prison time for a crime she never committed. Christina's scheme, though intricate and dangerous, now hinges on whether her fabricated evidence will be strong enough to convince the court and the authorities. Meanwhile, Ava finds herself in a difficult situation, as what she thought was a closed chapter now threatens to destroy her future. The battle between Christina and Ava has now evolved into more than just a confrontation between two individuals, it is a war between two completely opposing worlds. On one side, Christina, driven by a desire for justice and revenge for the loss of her child, on the other, Ava, who feels deceived and defeated by the cruel scheme. The hatred between them is no longer just a matter of harsh words, it has become a deadly struggle, where every move one makes could mean a setback for the other. This tense situation has made it impossible for both sides, and everyone around them, to predict the outcome of this battle.